ballet practice, kindergarten, grocery store, Sunday school, the pumpkin patch, goodwill. I made my parents call me lady, wishbone, lassie, pork chop. The life of a dog is easy after all, so why not? I was 19, the first time I was ever called a bitch. It was said to me at 2 a.m. over Facebook Messenger when I told a guy that I did not return his desperate sentiment. His vocabulary was the cliché rhetoric of those who believe in the mythical friend zone. How dare you not like me back? You are a tease. You are a lead on. You are a bitch. But all I could hear was you or a dog, you are a very bad dog, you have forgotten your training, learn to take command, stay, obey, lay yourself down, do whatever it is that I say. And you think that all I could should be capable of is to be told when to roll over. You think you can command me to come, tell me I am your good girl, look, you Robin Thick glorifier, let me make this crystal clear. I would rather be a bitch than your lovesick puppy. I am a greyhound at running prejudice, intolerance, and sexism. I am a St. Bernard railing through frozen tundra in search of victimized women to assist. I am a black love helping the blind who cannot see that misogyny kills. I am a blue healer pissing inside of your favorite fedora. I am a domination carrying my hands at unwanted groups in my life. I am a Doberman mauling anyone who lays a non-consensual finger on me or my friends. I am a chihuahua ready to rip out your throat. I'm a pit bull receiving stereotyped judgment when all I want to do is shake. I'm a great dame, giant but gentle. I am a Yorkie, little but fierce. I am a corgi frolicking through life in the pursuit of happiness. I am a German shepherd, loyal to a fault. And I was wrong when I was five. A dog's life is not easy, yet I know a destiny when I see one. I know what my life has and will become, and you cannot put me to sleep just because I do not please. Like a dog, once I am kicked, I do not forget. 